Hey, this is Gabe Mangel, and today I'll be showing you how to test a starter relay. This one came out of a Murray lawn cart, but the ones in cars are pretty similar, so this should apply to a lot of things. You're not going to need a whole lot of tools for this, just a 12 volt battery charger, a multimeter, and a couple of test leads. What those are have a couple different names but it's essentially just a wire with some alligator clips on the end of it to jumper the starter relay into activating. You're going to want to make sure before you plug it in that the leads on the 12 volt battery charger are not crossing or bridge. The 12 volt side the positive side goes to one end of the starter relay and the other one is just grounded to the body on the bottom Now we can pick up our multimeter and make sure that we have 12 volts coming into the starter relay before we start testing it. It's a little bit low, but as you can see, we got voltage coming in. Battery charger is kind of old, but it does do its job. This should be good enough, and now we're going to pick up the test lead, which is, like I said, just a couple alligator clubs. You might see some sparks when you connect it. And even without a multimeter, if you hear a clicking noise, that should be a good indication that it's working. The voltage is kind of low just because the starter, not the starter really, but the battery charger is a little bit wonky, but as you can see there is voltage coming across. 